Okay, we're in the lab. We uh, got the shaker table running. Uh, we've got some more space here in the lab. So uh, we got the buckets going. Show you what we got. Uh, we had to design a chute right here to fall into the bucket. We got this one falling into the bucket. We're not separating these two. They're just the same. This one is um, possible gold. This one is anything heavy that's gold. And it's going into a uh, Coke bottle. We've got water piped in. We've got circulating. Got the battery. We had to add some more weight, so I used some buckets of soil to add weight to the table. These pylons didn't work too good. They, they held a little bit, but then they started walking, so we added more weight to it. Um, got some material. It enters in here. Water runs. Let me grab some here. Grab a little bit of material just to show you. Let me put some material in there. You can hear it is starting to uh, vibrate. We got to anchor it a little better. But it goes down here, works down. Heavies will catch in here if they're possible. And if it makes it through here, then it makes a line. And you can see the line here. We've got it, the trash running over here. The heavies walk over there. So what we'll do every once in a while, we'll take a dime. And we'll throw a dime in there and we'll watch it walk. And that dime should end up in that upper left corner. We're close to it. So before it drops down in there, we'll take that. So even if it goes in here, I can rerun it again and adjust it. And um, it'll go into this bucket here and I'll rerun the material again and adjust the height and, and separate the gold a little bit better but there's a piece of gold right there um, did see a lot of fine gold on the one bucket that we ran uh, it was it was a good line of uh, gold in there but uh, what I'm doing is I'm running this second bucket again and that's why this isn't shaking I'm taking some weight off of it so I'm gonna switch these out but uh, that's the table. We had to make some modifications to it. Uh, right here, this bounces. So they didn't anchor this to where it screws into this metal. So that would be an adjustment we'll make later on is we'll screw this post into this metal so that the whole thing doesn't sit there and bounce as noisy as can be. Uh, a couple of the bracket, one bracket back there uh, was not lined up properly at the factory. So we had to take a hammer and knock it around so that it would line up so we could mount it to the stand um, a couple of screws were loose uh, the motor when we first got it was hanging loose it had a bolt come out um, none of this it's got a warning here but none of this is GFI protected so we have to we're gonna put some GFIs on here and and, and this is not a waterproof box next to a water outlet so we're going to uh, change that box out and make it a, a waterproof box or a watertight box. Um, other than that, like I said, we had to tie the bottle up here to hold on because it kept dropping down into the bucket. So other than that, it's doing good. It is collecting gold.